Hey, look at this. This is my newspaper website's Jeet Metrics score. And, I will optimize this to this score. And if you have a portfolio or business websites then you will score this. Because my newspaper website contains hundreds of images and elements on the homepage. Just stick around to see the steps. You see my current performance is not good, the website load time is more than 6 seconds. The image size and various script sizes are shown here. Our website is full of content, images, JS, codes, etc. Also, this page is very long. So, now get the WP Rocket plugin first, the link is given in the description. I already purchased that, and now I will install the plugin. After activation, you will see this interface. Our plugin is activated successfully. This is the dashboard where you see the license, cash clear option, etc. The file optimization tab is where you handle CSS and JavaScript settings to improve loading speed. Minify CSS files, this option removes unnecessary spaces and comments from your CSS files, reducing their size. Use it to maximize performance. I am enabling it. Optimize CSS delivery. Select between load CSS asynchronously or remove unused CSS. Optimize CSS delivery can boost your core web vital score. Remove unused CSS. WP Rocket analyzes and removes CSS not used on your site, resulting in lighter files. Use cautiously, as this could cause rendering issues. Load CSS asynchronously. Ensure CSS files are loaded in parallel, minimizing render blocking issues. Make sure one thing. After enabling those, don't look at JavaScript file optimization. Just scroll and save changes. And check the website design. Whether everything is fine or broken anything. Everything is fine. Let's go back to WP Rocket. Enable Minify JavaScript files, similar to the CSS option, this removes unnecessary space and comments from JavaScript files, making them smaller and faster to load. Combine JavaScript files, this merges JavaScript into fewer files to reduce HTTP requests. Be careful! It may not work well with sites using HTTP-2, as HTTP-2 already handles multiple requests efficiently. My current hosting server is not supporting this, that's why it's disabled by default. Load JavaScript deferred. Delaying JavaScript ensures it loads only after the website's HTML content is rendered, improving loading speed. Recommended for better user experience. Delay JavaScript execution. Ideal for interactive elements. This option defers script loading until the user interacts with the site. I am skipping the safe mode. Because we are testing our website manually. Once adjustments are made, remember to click Save Changes to apply all settings. Now checking our website again. Nothing broke. Let's go back to the Media tab. Lazy Load is a feature designed to enhance your page load speed by deferring the loading of images. My WordPress theme already has this lazy load feature enabled, that's why I am skipping this. If your theme doesn't have, then I prefer to enable them all. Image dimensions, this option automatically adds missing width and height attributes to your images. Why is this important? It helps prevent layout shifts during page loading, improving visual stability and ensuring you provide a better user experience for your visitors. Fonts, the self-host Google Fonts option allows you to serve font files directly from your server. This reduces external server requests and speeds up rendering, minimizing potential layout shifts caused by delays in font loading. It's an excellent way to optimize font performance while maintaining design consistency. Now go to the Preload tab. Preload Cache. When you activate preloading, WP Rocket scans your home page and XML sitemap to build the cache for all internal links automatically. 
This ensures your pages are preloaded and ready to load faster for users, even when they visit for the first time. Preloading is especially useful for maintaining quick load speeds after clearing your cache. Preload links. With link preloading, users will perceive faster browsing as WP Rocket downloads the target page when a visitor hovers their mouse over a link. Preload fonts. Adding your font files to the preload fonts section improves their loading priority. WP Rocket will tell browsers to discover the fonts earlier so that they render faster. You can add the font here manually. Just go to Jeet Metrics Waterfall, then go for Fonts and get the URL of the largest sized font. Copy that and paste it here. Now save changes. Now go to the Advanced Rules tab. Cache Lifespan, cache files older than the lifespan set here will be automatically deleted and refreshed. I am using a 24-hour cache lifespan here. These options are specially designed for e-commerce websites. If you wanted to explain them too, ask me in the comment section. Up next, it's the Database tab. The Post Cleanup section helps you remove unnecessary drafts, revisions, and deleted posts from your database. This reduces clutter in your database and saves space while improving back-end performance. It's particularly helpful for content-heavy sites that regularly make updates. Comments Cleanup This option permanently deletes spam and trashed comments. Regularly running this task keeps your database clean and ensures it's not bloated with irrelevant content from spam bits. Transients Cleanup Transients are temporary database entries created by WordPress or plugins to speed up page loads. If not removed, old transients can accumulate and negatively affect database performance. This option allows for quick cleanup without affecting your site. Automatic Cleanup Automating your cleanups can save you time and effort. After enabling this option, WP Rocket will regularly clean up unnecessary data based on your preferences, ensuring ongoing optimization without manual intervention. You can schedule the time period to daily, weekly, or monthly. If you have any paid content delivery network or CDN, then you can add it here. But I already showed a complete step-by-step -step tutorial on how to get and connect the best free CDN on the WordPress website, you can see that video. Heartbeat tab. Control Heartbeat, the WordPress Heartbeat API is used for background tasks like auto-saving posts and scheduling actions. However, excessive activity can consume server resources. By enabling Heartbeat control, you can reduce its frequency or disable it completely. In the Add-ons tab, you will see some tools that are to be connected to your website. Just like Varnish, Securi, or Cloudflare. If you don't have any of them, then you can skip it. Next is Image Optimization. WP Rocket recommends the Imagify Image Optimization plugin. It plays a very important role in the speed optimization process. Then, it's Tools section. You can easily export the WP Rocket settings and import them to different websites. So, our WP Rocket WordPress plugin settings are done. Let's check our website. It's fine. Go to Tmetrics and check the speed. Look, the current speed grade is significantly improved. The website load time is 2 seconds. These codes are optimized very well. If you had a business website or simpler design website then I am sure that this score would be 92 plus. And there you have it. Play around with the settings, test your website, and let me know in the comments what worked best for you.
Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more WordPress tips. See you in the next video.